Greeting, greeting. This is Mark Brown. We're going to be looking at how we can use WhatsApp and our Dexa computer. Yes, Dexa computer. To see how we can create a group or we can download photo or file from that particular group. So I'm going to be guiding you through that particular process. So very important there. All right, if you notice right over here, this itself is the WhatsApp. All right, so the first thing I wanted to do, I want to right click on it or I can come right down here and click on it to open it. Right, as soon as it open, you will see exactly what taking place. All right, so we actually this is actually known as the WhatsApp web section. All right, so let me take this here down here. All right, if you notice right up here, we show into WhatsApp. You know what it actually showing that it actually loaded. All right, so this is another step again. I want you to pay close attention to. If you notice right up here. So to use WhatsApp on your computer, these are the instructions that you have to do, right? So you have to have your mobile phone near to you that you can actually connect it to and all that. So if you notice, this is safe, the QR code. So the first thing we tell us that you must open your WhatsApp on your phone. And tap, right? So as you say, it's at the top menu. If you notice, it's really good at. So it's really good at is on the right side on your phone. So when you click on that, you notice, you're going to see setting. You're going to click on setting. When you click on the setting, you know what you see definitely come up. You show it's a link devices. So you see one of these come up just like this. So what you have to do is just click on scan and just place it over this here. And then what eventually happen, you actually connect it to it, right? So I'm gonna actually scan it by putting it over to the thing. I'm gonna scan it and actually gonna link it. So as soon as the link, I will show you exactly where you can actually create the group and all that's in it. So it's very important right there on where you can actually use it on the desktop. And if you notice right here, it show you, so it actually linking. What it show you that it actually organizing the file so far. So very important. So this is how we actually can actually use the WhatsApp on our desktop where we have to link it, right? And you, you see you over here, you notice right over here, you actually see the messages so far, right? And if you notice, this is my profile picture up here, right here, my profile picture. So definitely, if I wanted to search for somebody in this profile, I can click right here. So you notice if I click right here, I can actually type B. When I type B, you notice how the person name will be come up. And uh, that's a chart is here for me to look on it, and I can press this, and I can go back with that search. But if you notice right here, this is my profile. And if I click on my profile, this is what it actually shows my profile. Right? And show that I can actually do some other stuff right here. I can actually change it and all that. You can actually come right here and change the profile picture. I click right here and I go back. And if I come right here, I'm going to click on this. But notice, this show the status of what's going on so far. So in order for me to close the status, I can come right here and click. And there you go. But if you notice, it's a plus. When I click on the plus, you notice right here, you show that I can create a new chat right here. And right here, you show that I can actually search for something. Just the same, type, up, type S, you notice. That's the same. I come like this, go back, it's right here. I can create new group. So if I click, and if you create new group, it will show me that I can actually select, I can actually type the group name right here. Yes, that's how I can type the group name. All right, and when I finish, I can actually create it. So. Go back a bit, all right. If you notice right here, so when I go back with the arrow come up here, you notice you have the chill code that's right up here again. And so we're going to click on it. When you click on it, right here, show that I can actually create new group just the same. Right here, show that I can archive it, that you can actually go and look at it later on. Right here, you can actually start it. When you talk about star, you know, it's like you literally a mark it, make it different from the rest of stuff them, all right. And this is self after the settings. And this right now, when you click on this, you actually lag you back out of it. All right, so if you put that right there. So what I wanted to do, I want to click on one of these stuff. All right, so I'm going to click on this group here. I want to click right here on this group. You notice everything show up over here. All right, so let me move this area here. All right, it's very important. I'm going to show you exactly how, how it will work. How it will work. So definitely, if you notice, let me put it right here if you notice right down here see that mic that you can literally talk on right there if you notice the way so it shows a bless and all that so what if i want to follow this picture here 
what you wanted to do, you notice right out here, see? Be sure that I can actually search. If I click right here, you see the search. If you notice, you look at that right here. When you click on it, you look at that. What you see, group info. So this should actually show you of the group info, right here. So you notice it's where the group info right here. So you can come right here. You can actually click, get rid of it again. All right, so you click again. Right here, sure that you can actually select the message. You can actually mute the notification from coming. You can clear out all the message. You can exit the group. But if I click right here, it says select the group, the message rather. You notice there's a box come up over here. But if I click into one of these boxes, for instance, if I come right here and I click here in this box, if you notice immediate down here to the right, I can start it, I can delete it right here. But if you notice right here, I can actually use this and forward it. If I want to download it, I can download it from here. So if somebody said, no, let me be a document on your WhatsApp. If I want to connect it to here, on your desktop right here, you can actually download it from this angle right here. Yeah, it's very important, All right? But you can actually do that in a particular area there. All right, so if you want to sign back out of it, what you can do, you can come right here, you click, I can actually sign out. But before you sign out, what you can actually do again, you can actually, Put a document inside of it if you want to do that. All right. If you notice right here, you can close it right now. If you notice right here, I can put an emoji. If I come right here, you notice a whole lot of emoji come up right here. All right. I can actually choose one if I want. I can come right here and I can close it. If I want a document, I can come right here. You notice a file. I can actually click. And notice this one here. I'm sure, they can send a contact right here. I can get the document from right here. And surely, sure that you can actually use the camera. All right, right here, you can just give a strike and you can also insert a photo. You can also copy a link and paste it right inside here. If you want to make a voice thing, you can come right here. Just the same. So, what if you click on an individual? All right, if you come right here, so you click on this individual one now. All right, what you will notice when you click on individual, you notice right up here, you can actually make a video call immediately. Here, you can actually make a call. You notice you haven't seen that to the group right so far. So, very important. So if you come right here, so you click, you notice it's actually show the same thing up there. So if you want to get rid of this video here, first thing you want to do right here is select message. And then when I do that, I come right here, just like that, you notice. And then I'm going to come right down here, so I'm going to click. And rush from here. notice right here, so delete message, notice where cancel, and say delete for me. So I click that, I notice, there you go, and it's gone. All right, so very important. And that's exactly all we, all we do so far, right? And as you can see, when you finish, I wanted to sign out. You can come right here. You look at that right here. When you click on it, you can come right here, sign out. I can click on the sign out. If you notice right here, it's a login out. So this is exactly all you have to log out of the WhatsApp web, right? And this will take you exactly right back to the beginning where you were from the beginning. If you notice right here, it takes you right back to the beginning. All right, it's very important. So I hope you have learned something from this particular video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.